Hi, I'm Dr. Cece Dixon, and I want to welcome you to your Humanities 102 course. I'm very excited to have you in class. I think we're going to have a really, really fun semester, and I just want to go over a few important pieces of information that you need to know in order to start the semester off right and be successful in this class. When you log into the course, you should see this announcements screen. This is where I'm going to do my communication with you guys as a class. If I need to communicate with you individually, I will do that through mail. But it is important for you to every day log into our course and check announcements. It'll be the first thing you see and your mail. I want you to do this so you don't miss any important information. Reminders about due dates, deadlines, meetings, virtual meetings that we might have scheduled. Please make sure that you are checking in every day. Even if you don't plan to do work in the course every day, please make sure that you are checking announcements and your mail at least once every 24 hours. This will just ensure that we are communicating effectively with each other. Okay, so the first thing I want you to do is what is stated here in this first announcement. I want you to click on the Getting Started link and you will see some basic nuts and bolts of the class. Um, you will see here the textbook that you need, how to get in touch with me outside of Blackboard. We will have virtual conferences throughout the term that I will schedule with each of you individually. However, if you need additional help, I'm happy to schedule a virtual meeting with you on Wednesdays of each week. And of course, I'm always available through email. I prefer that you email me through Blackboard. I will respond to emails within 24 hours. However, if you email me over the weekend, it will be Monday more than likely before I respond. This is your course syllabus. Please make sure that you open it and read it because you're responsible for all of the material in it. Very quickly, I want to go over the course grading and due dates for this class. First, we'll do the grading. You have three units, Renaissance unit, Revolution unit, and Modernity unit. There are quizzes and assignments and discussion board posts within each unit. All of those unit assignments will add up together and count for 10% of your grade. So all of the assignments in the Renaissance unit added together is 10% of your grade. All of the assignments in the Revolution unit added together 10% of your grade. Modernity unit, the same thing. At the end of each unit, you will have a unit test. So you can see unit one test that will cover the Renaissance, unit two will cover revolution, unit three will cover modernity. And those each are 20% of your grade. These will be proctored through Examity. The unit assignments are not, but the tests are. And then you will have a final project or paper you get to choose um, and that is 10% of your grade. If you work diligently and manage your time effectively, you should be successful in this course. Please work each week in this class. Do not wait until the night before the due date to begin your assignments. You will not finish and you will not be successful. Um, so as soon as you can complete an assignment, please submit them and I will grade them as soon as I get them. Here are your due dates. 
and you will notice something very interesting here. I don't have weekly due dates. I have due dates you probably have four to five weeks to complete each unit. Again, you must work along weekly, whether that's setting aside a couple of days a week to work on this class, um, however you manage your time. Please understand there is too much information to wait to the last minute. This class is not difficult, but there is a lot of material. And my most successful students are ones who manage their time well. If you need strategies for that, please reach out to me. I will also reach out to you. If I see inactivity for a week, I'm going to get up with you. So please make sure that you understand the importance of managing your time in this class. Notice for each unit that you have two discussion board posts. We'll talk about those more in a minute. Each unit test is going to be proctored through Examity. You, can, you will have a live proctor. You have to make your reservation at least 24 hours before you want to take the test. You will be able to take the test anytime between 12 a.m. and 11 p.m. on the dates of the unit tests. And those dates are listed below. You can go ahead and schedule those now if you want to. They're ready to be scheduled. You do that in the, on the content page. I'll show you how to do that. This is a quick video on how to check your grades and get feedback. Um, the required software, um, other information, and then the first quiz you must take. This is due January 16th, but I suggest that once you've read the information on the Getting Started page, that you go ahead and take that first quiz and then begin working in the main content of the class. So to do that, you'll click on Content. And I just want to show you how the course is set up so you'll understand the importance of managing your time, if nothing else. So the first thing you'll notice is this course Q&A discussion forum right here. This is um, designed for you guys to communicate with each other. Think about this as space that you might take before a per an in-person class or after an in-person class to ask a question of each other, get clarification. You might even put, you know, I can't find the answer to this quiz question. I do not check the course Q&A. That is for you guys to communicate with each other. If you have a question for me, please send me an email. Okay, but that is for you to communicate with one another. So our first unit you'll see is January the 10th through February the 14th. And it is um, on the Renaissance. So here, let's click here. And again, I remind you of the unit due dates. I've also posted the study guide for the unit one test. I would go ahead and print this out. And as you work through the unit, you go ahead and complete the study guide. This is a great way to go ahead and start studying for the test. This is how to um, schedule your test through Examity. The requirements and what, what you will need to do that. You will notice that the first few assignments do not require the textbook. This changes. I do this so everyone will have time to get your book. So you can go ahead and work on these first assignments without your book. So please do that. 
please make sure that you read this information about the discussion board posts, instructions, and requirements. To begin, you have a couple of lectures, one on Renaissance values and one on the Medici and art. So you need to view these lectures and then you'll take the quiz. Okay, pretty simple. Then you have different um, maybe websites to go to, YouTube videos to watch. Um, you will need to click watch on YouTube here. Um, the video is age restricted, so we're not allowed to post those directly into Blackboard. I apologize, but you can just click on this link and it'll take you right there. After you watch um, this video, you'll take this quiz. Then you'll notice that you have your first discussion post. These are your initial post and your response post will both be due on the 27th of January. Then notice you've got a lecture to watch about humanism and you have a short reading assignment from a work called, called The Prince by a Renaissance writer named Niccolo Machiavelli. Then you will take this quiz. So after these first four assignments, notice then that you start to need your book. And so I give you specific pages to read. I provide you a lecture where I cover a material from those pages, and then you'll take a quiz. Anytime you have a reading assignment and a lecture, watch the lecture before taking the quiz. And you can scroll down and you can see all of the activities that are required of you for this first unit. Now, this is way more to do in 24 hours. And you do have discussion post deadlines in between our big deadlines. Please, please, please work along every week. I implore you. If you hear nothing else from me today, it is check announcements and mail every day and work along each week in this course. I'm super excited to have you guys. I think we're going to have a great semester. Please reach out to me if you have any questions at all, and I'm happy to answer them for you.